covering Fort Worth, Dallas, and all of North Texas. This is CBS 11 News at 6 in HD. Good evening, North Texas. Thanks for being here with us. I'm Doug Dunbar. And I'm Karen Borda. We begin with a breakthrough in cancer treatment. For the past year, CBS 11 has been following research trials here in North Texas. Scientists have developed a vaccine that fights cancer by using cancer. Today, researchers reported that those trials are a significant success. It's a story you'll see only on CBS 11. Inside this Carrollton Medical Lab, researchers are working on the front lines in the fight against cancer. I'm tired of curing cancer in mice. Uh, let's get it into people. Doctors John Newmanitis and Neil Senzer from the Mary Crowley Cancer Research Center head up the clinical trial for a vaccine called FANG. And the specificity we're able to get to in terms of what's making cancer work and how to block that is um, remarkable. Each vaccine is different because it uses a patient's own tumor. Surgeons remove as much as they can and then use those cells to create the therapy. We're now able to look at the differences between normal cells and cancer cells and try to target our therapy to the differences. You know, it uh, was a little bit mysterious to me. I wasn't sure how it worked. Dallas businessman Alan Newberry has been battling prostate cancer for years. Just relax your arms. Okay. But after receiving doses of the Fang vaccine made from his own tumor, his body has been able to fight back. They create a vaccine that isn't just for prostate cancer, it's for Alan Newberry's prostate cancer. It's got my DNA. What we're trying to do is to dismantle the stealth system that the cancer cell has. So the immune radar system, which we've now revved up, not only can see it, but can produce ways to attack those cancer cells more effectively. In the study's first published report out Thursday in the journal Molecular Therapy, scientists say they saw statistically significant prolonged survival in patients with advanced stage disease. In the phase one study, they report that just after two months of starting the vaccine, the disease was halted in almost all of the more than two dozen patients. Those who received the vaccine lived at least two years longer than those who went untreated. Thank you, you're doing great. Alan Newberry is living proof. Today, he is cancer free. Standard treatments such as chemotherapy come with serious side effects, but the FANG vaccine has little to no adverse effects. The phase one study worked on patients with various forms of cancer, including ovarian, breast, colorectal, and melanoma.